Okay, so here's how we're going to change or add the oil. So you're going to get 5W30 synthetic, ideally. And the first thing we're going to do is disconnect the generator from the house. just disconnected the generator from the house. We're going to open the top. And we hit the off button. All right, so we disconnected the generator from the house by pushing the uh, large 100 amp, 70 amp, whatever you have, um, breakers off. We hit the off button. We're now going to lift the front. You just lift the front panel up and you pull it off. And depending on when the last time it was lifted off, it could be a little sticky. So as you see, these generators become a mess. Here's the oil fill, where you're going to fill the oil, and here's where you check the oil. You're not going to change the oil filter, you're just topping off the oil. Make sure at the bottom, if you have any oil, make sure you let us know that. Um, so what we're going to do is check the oil level. So we're going to ah, pull that out and it can be very, very hard and very sticky. Okay, you're going to check the oil level between those two dots. This one needs oil. Clean it with a paper towel. Put it back in, push it all the way down. It could be tough because when it's hot, it can be a little sticky. There it is all the way down, pull it up. And we see that we are low on oil. We're at the lower, we're at the lower dot. So we're gonna add oil here. Really important not to add a lot of oil. Let me say this again. Do not add a lot of oil. Let me say this one more time. Do not add a lot of oil, okay? Half a quart at a time. And then check the, dip uh, the dipstick and um, check your oil level. But half a quart at a time is all you need. Okay, if your generator turns off because you are uh, low oil pressure, that means you're out of oil, you're gonna come here you're going to hit off like we did. You're going to add your oil. You're going to hit enter twice. Enter, enter. Okay? Then you're going to hit auto. And it should all start up. No problem. Um, I'm going to now add oil to my generator. And call us if you have any problems. Remember, call Adam's cell phone for any technical issues. Thank you.